ProWatch Integrated Security Suite enables an enterprise to benefit from the seamless integration of all of its security solutions, giving you complete visibility of all the connected systems, in turn mitigating business risks. It's designed to protect people and property, optimize productivity, and ensure compliance with industry regulations. And it saves time and money by providing actionable intelligence and reducing operational costs. This video provides the installation procedures and information necessary to install the 5.5 of the ProWatch Access Control System. Please note the recommendation below before you proceed for the installation. Microsoft Windows Server 2008, 2012, or 2016 is recommended for the ProWatch server. Without any ado, let's start the video. The user should install SQL Server manually for the start of the installation of the ProWatch. Use the following section to install SQL. SQL Express will support a 10 GB database. For bigger database, install SQL Standard or Enterprise Edition. Install SQL Express or SQL Standard or Enterprise as per project requirements. Go to the installation and click New SQL Server Standalone Installation. Then accept the licensing terms. Then click on Next. Select the desired features to be installed. And then click on Next. Customize the instance name or use the default then click on Next. Select the service startup type, then click on Next. Select Mixed Mode, then click Add Current User. Skip Error Reporting and then click on Next. Wait for the installation to finish. Then click on Close to finish the installation. Once the user finishes the SQL installation, then we need to start ProWatch software installation. In this video, we are going to install the 5.5 ProWatch software, which is released in this year 2022. Let's start the installation. Open the folder ProWatch 5.5. Then go to ProWatch 5.5.0.12711, Disk 1 folder. Then go to the Disk 1 folder. Then go to the ProWatch installation folder. Then go to New Installation. And then double click the ProWatch Software Suite file, or right click on the application file and select Run as Administrator. Once the user clicks on the application, to start installation, the ProWatch Software Suite setup will start preparing the Install Shield wizard, which will guide the user through the program's setup process. Please wait. Once the preparation is completed, the ProWatch Software Suite Install Shield Wizard will open. Click on Next. Then accept the terms in the license agreement by clicking on the checkbox. And then select Next again. Select the checkbox for the ProWatch Software Suite. Then click on Next. Select the configuration as a complete ProWatch installation. And then select the SQL version you are using or which we installed earlier. If no SQL Server is installed, then the Select SQL version will not be there. Then click on Next to continue. Here users have to configure ProWatch Server. Select Service Account Logon Type as Normal Logon Account. Then type the username of your server. Then select Domain as your computer name from the drop-down list. Then enter the password for the Windows login of your server. Once user enter the complete information, then click on Next. Here the users can change the database path as needed, but it is not recommended to change the default database path. To continue click on Next. Here it is recommended to select the Install Sample Report option, if you don't there won't be any reports. Then leave the default name of the ProWatch database as PWNT. Then click on Next to continue. Here is the review installation configuration. And when you are ready, click on Install to start the installation. Once the user clicks on Install, a pop-up window will generate where you will see that it is recommended to enable Transparent Data Encryption TD, for the ProWatch database to secure the data at reset. 
Please refer to the Security Manual Encryption, SQL Server Database section, for the details. Just click on OK, to continue the installation. Wait, till the installation is completed. When the installation completes, be sure to reboot the server. After the installation is completed, click on Finish. Once the user clicks on the Finish button, a pop-up window will open. You must restart your system for the configuration changes made to the Pro Watch Suite to take effect. Click Yes to restart now. Or No if you plan to restart later. After the server reboot you may find that a message that says the client cannot connect to the server. This indicates that the Pro Watch service is not yet started. I will be uploading a series of videos for the ProWatch server, where we will cover all the critical issues which will be faced by the programmer, on site. So stay tuned, and check the update on regular basis. You can get the technical support at any time, you just need to get the membership on our channel. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel.